Hey there guys, Alan Santo here. here. Now, here I'm going to bring up a spe special show that nobody seems to talk about much because people love, want to hate it so badly and I don't know why people hate this show but it's kind of a real suggestion. But this is a big one, it's called The Boom Quill. Ham. Now, as you all know, it was a show that was on Kids WB from 2004 to 2005, I believe. I mean, I don't know if there were any reruns of the show or whatever. But, you know, it was created by Bruce J. Smith, the guy you know from who did Baby's Kids and The Proud Family, which I both, which I like both of them really well. Now, now, this show was an interesting show on my part because. Let me tell you, I haven't watched this show growing up, and it's kind of a huge surprise that a lot of people disliked it. Let's go, let's go to the plot here. After four foster children, Justin, Nate, Jube, and Wiggy, Wiggy create a video game, suddenly a supernatural vortex appears and pulls them into a, to a world which is really similar to their game. The show also teaches the Avengers in this parallel world as they embark on a quest to find the missing game cartridges and stop the sadistic emperor extraterrestrial terrorist Sork from taking over the intergalactic dimension. Yeah. That's pretty much what it says to. Now, it's kind of a huge surprise that a lot of people seem to not like this movie, like the show very much. As you can see, um, I checked on TV.com and it got a 2.9 user rating, and I went on IMDb and it got a 3.0% and it got a 3.0% rating. Yeah. And, yes. And, and on top of that, everyone is saying that it's a whip off of Samurai Jack, but yeah. But I don't know. This is this really the big the big letdown for animation? I mean, is it really the worst? That, that animation has to awful. I mean, have you guys saw the Emoji movie? I mean, have you even seen the Emoji movie? Because let me tell you, that didn't work well, but I saw worse than the Emoji movie. I saw worse than the Boom Crew. I mean, I mean, the Garbage Pro Kids is probably the worst in kids entertainment. I mean, the Nostalgia Critic made a video on that, and I can definitely see why Garbage Pro Kids is way worse. Besides, nice. And for those of you who want to see Gar the Garbage Pro Kids movie, do not because it will totally, totally mess you up. It will totally mess you up. And I'm hoping that no one saw, saw, saw Garbage Bear Kids because I am faithful I didn't saw Garbage Bear Kids. I'm just too busy watching Spongebob or Fairy Odd Parents or Phineas and Fall went there. Yeah. So, um, basically, I don't think the Boom Crew is that bad. I mean, I saw worse than this. I mean, I saw Bread Wars and it didn't live up well. I mean, there's also Butt Ugly Martians, The Adoring Orange, The Problem Solvers. I mean, those are animated shows that I despise and I never want to see. Ever. So, the Boo Boo, I don't, I, don't think on, I don't think it's on the level of The Problem Solvers. Um, I think it's more on the, I, I don't know, I don't know why, but I think it's more on the lines of The Mighty Bee or Tag of the Power of Juju when it was a meh cartoon for me. So it's kind of a meh show on my part, yeah. So for those of you who think it's a meh show or a bad show or partially good, I don't know why, but this is my own opinion. I think the show is okay. It's a little meh, but it's still okay. So hope you don't mind. And it's just my silly personal opinion. You can make your own opinions on your own. So, so if you're really interested in seeing the Boom Crew, go check on what go check on Watch Cartoon Online. No, which is called, this is called WatchCartoonOnline.com. You can see the, you can see the whole show right there. So anyway, that's all the time I have for today. I'm Alan Sartell, and I'll see you guys next time.